Boy, I be telling brothers. I be telling brothers all the time. I know the grass may look greener. But it ain't. It's not. I hate to tell you. Oh, I know it looks so nice and calm on the other side. I just know it do. But guess what? Guess what? That ain't reality. That ain't reality. Ebony, ivory, living in the world with harmony. Ebony, ivory. <laughs> Boy, ain't nothing changed up under the sun, homie. Ain't nothing changed up under the sun. Now, I say all that to say this right here, man. Black man, black man, I know I go hard on our women. That's because I love them. And I, 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 I go hard on them, but guess what? I don't leave them neither. I don't leave them neither. I stick with my sisters all Mickey Ficky Day. All Mickey Ficky Day. It just seems like when you make a name for yourself and you get out there outside the circumference and you get yourself on another level, you go get you you gonna get you some uh, <laughs> uh, some jiffy, some jiffy cornbread, or some colonial, colonial bread. We'll say that. <laughs> and the first little thing that happened, the first little disagreement, it come to tears. It come to oh. Then next day, you know, black man, your ass is in the grass. Like I said, black man, hey, I go hard on our sisters, but I tell you, man, I can't see myself with nobody but the black woman. Man, ask, your, ask your boy Jonathan Majors. Man, I already know this man here. Running in and out and running, running in and out of traffic. And then he get hit with the assault thing. Boy, I tell you, boy, Becky is off the chain with it. You're Karen too? Becky, Karen, Jennifer, all of them. Brothers, you better you better stick with your can, buddy. You better stick with your can. So check this out right here though. My man Jonathan Majors, he will no longer be playing the Dennis Robin in the movie. You're supposed to get a role to play Dennis Rodman. But all, since all that, that garbage and that turbulence happening, uh, you know, he won't even get that opportunity. And battle actor Jonathan Majors will no longer play basketball player Dennis Rodman in a proposed film project. Multiple sources tell CNN. More than a year ago, Majors was cast to star Rodman in the film which chronicled the basketball player's infamous trip to Las Vegas during the 1998 NBA Finals. Oh, no. While an individual close to the movie working title 48 Hours in Vegas, cautioned that Majors has not yet officially been dropped from the film, the sources say the actor will not be part of the project. Mm-mm-mm. All oh, that turbulence, man. All oh, that turbulence. And look what all of them cost. I'm telling you, boy, y'all better stick with y'all sister. And you know that don't mean sister y'all go out there act all crazy. Yeah, I told you, you stick with... uh, Just calm down. Tame, tame, tame it. Lord have mercy. Last month, a jury found Majors guilty of assault and harassment of his former girlfriend, Grace Jabari, uh, during a domestic dispute. Majors, who remained his innocence, was convicted of one court of reckless assault in the third degree of a non-criminal charge of harassment and violation. He was acquitted on another assault charge and one count aggravated harassment. Woo! 
Now, I'm scared to even get a girlfriend these days like this, man. And going through shit like this and messing with, messing with the colonial. Boy, it's hard here. Along the first source, two additional sources tell CNN that Lion Gates, the studio where Rob and Film landed in 2021, has released a uh, project back uh, to its producers to allow them to find a new partner to produce the film. All that, man. Now this man to miss our opportunities, making movies back down and double back. Fellas, learn your lesson. Saying, man, I'm just saying. Thank God he got your girl on his, you know what I'm saying? Oh, he got his back. But him going on that little tour, <laughs> apologizing and uh, I guess crying. Or fit. Man, that, that's like the oldest trick that they get us black men to go down through that old crap. Pick the biggest dude out there. Big, bad as I don't know where to get that appearance, but then to break him down in front of everybody. Yeah, what, what, what the hell is that, man? But I'm telling you, man, y'all been brothers. Brothers, brothers, I ain't gonna tell you nothing wrong. I ain't gonna tell you nothing wrong. I ain't gonna tell you nothing wrong at all. I promise I ain't. Major, uh, Major's legal issues were not the only factor in the behind the scenes changes. While the Loki star trouble certainly complicated matters, the sources say that, uh, that the producers were talks with the director who plans are beyond the film's budget. So Lion Gates allowed producers to take the project elsewhere to achieve their creative vision. The producers are currently shopping around the film without majors attached. The two additional sources say, and if the film ends up back in the Lion's Gates, the first source family states that majors will be let go. I could not imagine a world where the moves forward with Jonathan. One of the two additional individuals close to the project tell CNN noted that wherever the film ends up, Major will not be its star. See, that's what I'm saying. Is it if Becky worth is is it, is Becky worth it? Is she worth it, brothers? If you got one, y'all let me know. Is it worth it? Have y'all been through some crazy? Tell me the contrast. That you didn't got any disputes. All the issues y'all done came across since y'all started messing with Becky. You feel me? Look at the opportunities. You tell me. This is your boy Moose. Do me a favor. Like, share, and subscribe. Like, share, and subscribe. Peace and bother. Have great people. The last time. I'm going to tell him what he's going to face. And if he thinks that he can destroy the place that gave birth to Abraham that was once the seat of the Khilafah I will say to the President of the United States that the God that I represent who has power over wind and rain Rain, hail, snow, and earthquakes. If you think you have a bomb to destroy Baghdad, I will bound you that I will call on my God to show America that he can destroy not one of your cities, but every city that you've got with just one great earthquake. Many lives will be lost, but you got to know that you've been playing with God too damn long, and your days of playing with God is all over. God is tired of America, and God can end America like Jehovah ended Egypt and Pharaoh. Bush got to know this.